did it for myself right now, right? So what was supposed suppose to happen or expected to happen? Well, I wanted to give you a tool that you can actually use. So I did my, did my presentation a different way than usual. I'd usually do drown people in slides. I think it records 197 in 22 minutes. Cool. This time I did it a little bit different. So the plan was to do it with worksheets that people could actually use in hand. But so what actually happened was there was a loss of noise. <laughs> right? So in the sense that it worked, it engaged people. Right? And man. People did actually get concrete results out of it. Some people, anyway. No idea if you did, but certainly you'll see in front of me that I got concrete results. So the differences were, the source of differences, I was afraid that people wouldn't be engaged. And notice there's a positive here. People were engaged. Notice something as simple as this can get people engaged. Another one was it was blooming noisy. <laughs> yeah? I had difficulty getting your house out to think. We'll come back to that in a moment. That's a definite difference. So what can I learn from this to do differently next time? Well, I do need to be better at, I um, was reasonably good at timekeeping. Sorry, Michelle. Um, but it actually did work. We got the timing right. So in that sense, I've learned that I can, can, can manage time reasonably well. But what I do need to do is to realize that you know, I've got to watch much more closely in your case, for example, that you were on your own. Me. No, no, the, sorry, I missed you. We were yeah, yeah. Oh, right. You were on your own for a while, and I needed to, I should have made sure. I should have checked for that beforehand. I need to do that quite specifically. There was a three there, which made things a bit difficult. I should have split you up or attacked you or something. <laughs> what can we learn from this to do as a group? Well, one of the groups, one, the other people involved in this are the people in the next room. Right? And we've been really noisy. We should have been, next time we need to be much more soundproofed space to do this kind of stuff with this number of people. So that's the kind of thing. So notice straight away, we've got something that we can do. I haven't really got time because otherwise we're cutting into Michelle's. So if you've got questions, put them up on Slido. But if you've got any comments about what you've learnt about this. But notice how something this fast, if I may grab again, can give you some actual insights if you build this as a habit every single time you do something, you can see how fast you're going to learn. Right? Really simple, really fast, really effective. You can also see how strongly it depends on those rules. Pin your stripes at the door, no blame, we're here to learn. Okay? So I hope you found that useful. Okay. The slide sheets or the, the, the worksheets are there on the slide deck, otherwise I've got to set the slide deck back news. Thank you, Tom. Uh, so you can now go either into the next room or the one beyond. Tom is actually running a workshop that you can dip into if you if you feel like it. Okay, so you've got choices or even stay here. And we'll just spend a couple of minutes uh, while you move around.